How can I add course content to my Moodle site? A course in Moodle is basically a space on your Moodle site where one or more teachers can add learning content for their students. What the course might look like as a teacher will depend partly on the theme and the settings which you as the admin define. This course uses the Boost theme. With the Boost theme, teachers can expect to see a collapsible course index on the left and an expandable block drawer on the right. From the course navigation, settings, course teachers can edit the settings such as the course name and description. The more link takes you to further features such as the quiz question bank, the H5P content bank and more. Course teachers can toggle the button top right to enable edit mode and then they can make changes and additions to the course. The main content area here is where the actual teaching and learning resources will be added. In this course, there are new sections, which can be renamed. But if we look at a different course on a different Moodle site, you can see that these are divided into weekly sections and there are some blocks on the right. Content in the central area can be dragged up and down or in a long course across to a specified location in the course index. Content may be added by clicking the plus sign between activities or clicking add an activity or resource to get to the activity chooser. If subsections are enabled from plugins, manage activities, then a plus sign will display the option to add a subsection or an activity or resource. Activities require participation from learners, such as submitting an assignment, whereas resources are static, such as watching a video. The tabs here are controlled by you, the administrator, from Site Administration, Courses, Activity Chooser Settings. Blocks give extra information and learning resources and can be added by expanding the block drawer and clicking to add a new block. For more information, see our Educator Pathway on Moodle Academy. To summarise, courses hold learning content. Content may be moved by drag and drop. Resources are static. Activities require input from learners. Blocks may also be added to the side.